New details about why Feld Entertainment decided to shut down Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus. After nearly 150 years in show business, Feld says the greatest show on earth will come to an end in just a few months. ABC 7's Kate Flexter was at Feld's headquarters in Manatee County when the company made that official announcement. She joins us now live with more on what happens next. Kate. Good evening, Scott. John Ringling's legacy can be felt all around town, from the Ringling Museum to the Ringling Bridge to this circus ring of fame. And for that reason, many locally were devastated by the news. Welcome to the greatest show on earth. For more than a century, the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus went by the self proclaimed title, The Greatest Show on Earth and few dispute its truth. There was no show to work for like Ringling Brothers because it, it truly is the greatest show on earth. That made the news of the show shutting down all the more surprising for people like Aaron Watkins, who toured with the circus as a clown for about five years. I was shocked. Um, I, I think everyone I know was shocked. Once you get to 145 years old, you think, oh, okay, it's gonna be around forever, but they only made it to 146 years, unfortunately. Parent company Feld Entertainment made the announcement Monday, attributing the decision to a sharp decline in ticket sales, which dropped even more when the company retired the iconic elephants, following accusations of animal cruelty. The percentage drop was much more severe than what we anticipated, and that's what ultimately led uh, to this difficult decision. That decline, coupled with the high operating cost, made it an unsustainable business model. The decision affects the more than 400 people who work for the circus. We will be working with all of our people, including performers, to help them transition to other opportunities. For Watkins and many others, it's the end of an era. You'll never be able to afford to get that many creative people together again uh, to match the grander of the greatest show on earth. And that doesn't mean that circus is dead, but the great American circus, probably this is the, the death blow to it. But Feld insists the circus's legacy lives on. Live entertainment is not going away. The legacy of Ringling Brothers will exist in that it has infused all other live entertainment. If you're interested in checking out that final tour, it will be in Tampa next week. Live in Sarasota, Kate Flexter, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.